Hi guys, welcome back to another video. On today's video, I am at Taco Bell and I'm gonna do a Taco Bell mukbang. I'm gonna be trying their um, deluxe cravings box, which comes with a new burrito that is called the green, the salsa verde um, grilled chicken burrito. And it comes with a beef chalupa supreme and a crunchy taco. I don't think it's supreme, but yeah, it's a crunchy taco. And I'm also, oh, I made a mess. And I'm also gonna try the, um, Gordita Crunch. I've never had that before and I'm pretty excited. So, yeah. So I want to start off with a burrito because that's the new item and yeah. yeah. So this is what the burrito looks like. I'm gonna dip it into the um, cheese. Take a bite of it. I think it comes with steak. It comes with rice and salsa verde. Let me taste and get another bite. Mm. It's not bad. But it's not the best. I would say it's um eight out of ten. It's not bad, guys. I would come and try it. The rice tastes pretty good. So yesterday was New Year's Eve. This is a Gordita Crunch. I've never had this one before. Let me see. Where's my sour cream? Oh, you know, you know what I'm missing? I am missing sauce. I always eat my food with sauce. My goodness, how can I forget that? Let me put some sauce on it. This is the mild sauce. I always get mild sauce. Let's see. Mm -hmm. That makes it way, way better. Some cheese. Mm -hmm. Better. So, how was your New Year's Eve? Mine was really good. We celebrated my baby's birthday. He turned one. It's crazy to think that um, I was at the hospital. Well, I was coming out of the hospital at this time. Mm mm. It's 4.48 today right now. I got out of the hospital like at 5-ish, I think. Let's try it. Mm. I put some of the Diablo sauce. That's spicy. Mm. 
my sour cream is spicy oh yeah well i was at the hospital it's so crazy i mean and now he's one We um mm. so we celebrated New Year's Eve at my sister's house. She got her gallbladder removed a few weeks ago, and she's still recovering from it. So she isn't able to move a lot. So we, we were at my sister's house, and mm. we had pizza and salad. We normally go all out and with food and everything, but it's it was different this year. What did you guys have for New Year's? And what do you guys do? Like you know how people eat the twelve grapes and they go outside and run with the luggage, like for more trips or for the wishes. What did you guys do? I'm such a mess here. The only thing that we did was eat the 12 grapes. We ate the 12 grapes and we made the 12 wishes. So we'll see if they come true. It's good. I have always loved Taco Bell. I love it. Taco Bell is one of those restaurants that always has um like new items coming in. I haven't tried the pizza from Taco Bell, but I really want it, but I haven't done it. I could do it another another video or or is that too old already? This talk about where I live, it's really busy. Like there's always cars here. So it's a new year. Because we're back in January. Like we're back at the start. New year and let me know what other videos you guys want me to do. What other places you want me to try. Mm. The burrito. Chicken, rice. That Diablo sauce is spicy, but it's good. Let me add some sauce. Mm. The sauce is pretty good. The green one that comes with it. I love um Taco Bell's grilled chicken um chalupas. They're so good. They're like so soft. I was craving nachos with cheese today, so that's kind of why I came here. <laughs> so I just finished the gordita crunch and the. Salsa Verde um, burrito, and they were both 
good. I'm getting kind of full, so I'm gonna try the. I've already had a crunch taco, but I wanna eat it just for the crunch. And it also comes with another beef chalupa, but I wanna save that one because I'm not even. That's. I'm too, I just can't. Oh my goodness sorry guys so yeah i hope you all had a great start of the year so far and you guys were like oh, it's just another year like, come on what could happen but i think we should just be grateful that we woke up we're all still alive because honestly we could lose our life in a blink of an eye which is sad to think i think like i don't like to think that way Cause then I start getting anxiety. Okay, guys. I love talking about sour cream. Mmm. What is that place or restaurant that you guys, whenever you guys are hungry and it's late at night, like, what do you guys eat? Are you guys want to talk about or not? I used to go to Taco Bell all the time, but not anymore. I don't eat that late anymore. So I have a permanent retainer and it's been bugging me for like the past a week. I need to go to the orthodontics and get it fixed. But I've been pushing it to the side and not going. I hate that. I think it's because the location where I go when I got my braces, it's a really bad location. Like like not bad like scary but bad like the parking like i hate the parking like if the parking is like really tight i'm just avoid that location like i don't even go to that to the place not with anything like if i know i'm gonna struggle to park i'm not going i hate that about myself i'm not the best driver Fun fact, well, it's not actually fun. I didn't start driving until I was like 20 or 21. I can't even know. Mm -mm. I've been driving for like three years only. I, have, I had such a phobia, like I just couldn't drive. I would panic. And then a lot of random ladies started on. Um, everyone told me how to drive, and I just started driving slowly and a little bit, and just started. I got the hang of it. But it was the big, my biggest fear was driving. I thought about all the bad stuff that could happen. Like, mm -mm. I'm so. I'm so glad that I overcame that fear because driving is really important. And like you you need to drive. My mom is the same way. She has a driving phobia. And my niece also, Desiree, she has a driving phobia. Like she just like panic. I really hope they overcome it because it's important to drive, I think. It makes you independent. So if you don't drive and you have a phobia, I really hope that you overcome that fear.
all right guys that's the end of the video i really hope you guys enjoyed this video and just chit chatting with me don't forget to like comment and subscribe and happy new year i hope this year brings a bunch of happiness in your life and let me know what other videos you guys want to see this year so yeah i'll see you guys on the next one